what's going on my YouTube is it is your boy Ghostface Gaming back once again with another video upload for you guys this is a Dragon Ball Super chapter 53 discussion yeah I kind of got hung up for a second man I got to do a little different man how I uh how I decide to uh, do my videos for right now one my tablet is down so there won't be much work going on on my tablet and to every time I upload some uh, panels from the manga cover she way she taps me in the head so this is how we're going to be doing it for a while but uh I have my comic right here my issue of chapter 53 and we're going to review it and go over it so uh basically in chapter 53 we start off with Krillin and Piccolo on the lookout and they just completely plays my boy Yamcha they just completely plays Yamcha to the left you know that's a whole different topic but Jocko's trying to gather all of the strongest warriors he can possibly for this threat that is coming to planet earth so we're getting what I was asking for. We are getting some live, real live Z Fighter action, ladies and gentlemen. We're getting some real Z Fighter action. You can't be more excited or not. You know what I'm saying? Like, but <laughs> this is what we asked for in the Dragon Ball Super. You know what I'm saying? That we get more action from the side grade. But, um. <clears throat> as I'm pulling up the panel. So, for some reason Goku can't use Ultra Instinct. He has to be in a life or death situation. And pretty much that's what Mir is telling him. But anyway, we're going to get to this. So, we're on top of the lookout, right? And, you know, they got the, the guys that Piccolo fought before. They got him in some type of bird cage. And, you know, they're asking about Gohan and Tien Shithard, and they need all the fighters they can get on the Galactic Patrol, and Tian, Tian Shinhan doesn't have a cell phone for some strange reason, okay. and Gohan is at one of his conferences, but of course we know he'll be on the way. At this point, Jocko is actually trying to run away from the fight, <laughs> but, you know, they convince him to uh, stay around not to his own volition anyway and of course we find out which is usually all the same dragon ball trope that piccolo dende and eska are the last of their race at least for right now until we can get the dragon balls or the super we'll probably need the super dragon balls to bring namek back because i don't think shinron has the power to bring namek back or at least dende anyway but we'll see about that <clears throat> so anyway So anyway, they're talking amongst each other. Piccolo and Crit on the light. If they'll be here in 10 days, we got some time to train. If they'll be here in 10 minutes, we got some time to train. So, <clears throat> with that being said, <laughs> sorry, I my phone was ready to stop. With that being said, we pan over to the villains or you know the people from Moro's clique and they're flying through space and it's going to take them about like I said 10 days to get there so they're asking about earth what is earth this is that and the third you got this fat panda guy then you got this other demon looking guy I forgot it's like another cartoon with a demon that looks something like him and you got the hit knockoff, you know what I'm saying? OG73, you know what I'm saying? They should have went up another number and his name should have been OG74 to the world blow, you feel me? <coughs> but anyway, he's breaking down the schematics of planet Earth. They say they have to make a pit stop on the way. On the way there, they stop by this little small planet. This little small planet full of these hedgehog looking people. Now the thing about OG73 is... He's a biomechanical engineer 
specimen that's a killing machine that only obeys his allies. But he looks like a hit knockoff. So he might be from the hit race and just let people, you know, doctor on him or experiment on his body. But anyway, so he's on this planet. He's fighting these Sonic the Hedgehog looking people. They're spitting needles and pine cones or whatever come out their back at them. And he has this special ability or quirk for my My Hero Academia people. He has this special quirk where uh, he can grab the back of your neck and access your abilities for up to 30 minutes. And he does this and he molly wops through the Hedgehog people. He sees one of them trying to get away with some kind of teleportation. And he goes up, stops him from doing it, takes his ability and pop, teleports right on top of the lookout. <clears throat> No time wasted. So with no time wasted, they get ready to kill some of Moro's other goons that came to the planet. Some of Moro's other goons that came to the planet. Uh, they get ready to kill him. Piccolo lets him know there ain't no killing going on on top of the lookout or whatever. They get to fight and he's giving Piccolo a one for his money because he's using Piccolo moves because he was able to get behind him and get the jump on him. So, after Piccolo he gets the jump on Piccolo, the fight consumes. Krillin is fighting the panda dude. Jocko gets knocked off the lookout. And Piccolo and OG73 are going at it. Now, OG73 is also like an android. Like, why Piccolo always got to fight somebody with infinite stamina, bro? Hey, come on, bro. <laughs> but anyway, so <clears throat> he's getting that work put on him. Dude is using Piccolo's special bead caddy. And for what? The student has to save the master. Yes, Gohan comes in and saves Piccolo. And Piccolo lets him know, don't let him grab the back of your neck. He can, he can copy your powers, and he has infinite stamina. You're the strongest one here. So that, when Gohan says, so that must mean my dad and Vegeta are still off world. He panned over to Goku, like I was saying. He has to uh, get beat almost to the brink of death to activate Ultra Instinct, and Vegeta feels like he's wasting his time on Yard. So this is your boy, Ghostface Gaming. I want y'all to like, subscribe, and share to all social media platforms. I will come back and do another small video discussing further of Dragon Ball, chat Dragon Ball Super, Chapter 53, 150 more to plan. Go ahead and sub for that $25 gift card giveaway, and I'm out, y'all.